got to a little food stand and I bought some red and some bananas and never forget to bargain a place like this yes. I think that we are really lucky because of the pandemic there was no tourism at all and right now they are opening the gate or China in general is opening the gates again so people like us come here but right now we are the only ones here. Yeah, so yeah. there is nobody <laughs> there's nobody right now we are so lucky like always we're <laughs> just lucky <laughs> nice nice the hike's over we found the craziest mahjong table in the world look at this oh. that's two sets inside Whoa. two sets <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. <laughs> wow <laughs> <laughs> now we are playing mahjong like professionals. <laughs> Winning mahjong and listening to some traditional Chinese music. Our Beijing sightseeing tour goes on and welcome to the temple of heaven the largest temple in the world where people worship heaven as you can see it's very touristic here most of them are tourists from China but we heard that the sandstorm is coming today the air around us is getting yellow and dirty Here's a row, so if you want to pray, you can just go to the middle and pray in all directions. We got to the second part of the temple and the amount of tourists has not changed. So I can tell you that this sightseeing tour is not one of my favorites. If you have seen Karate Kid, this is the place where Jaden touched the door on his school trip in Beijing. Maybe you can remember. Look. So many people. This is crazy. The people are crowding up just to get some photos from the inside. Let's go in. Okay, so this temple, in my opinion, nothing crazy, but for many people, a holy place. Behind the temple, you got the last part of this building. So let's have a look. Actually, you cannot go inside, but you can have a look from the outside. The sandstorm is getting worse. We need to go. We are sitting inside the Peking train station going to Qiang. We got our snack. I don't know what they call them. Dumplings. Dumplings. We got our dumplings inside the plastic bag served. Look like this. And they are pretty nice. We got to the most local train in my whole <clears throat> life. We are sleeping in a six bed dorm. Salam. It's open, the sides are open, so everybody can just cross. And this is going to be our train for the next 15 hours. 15 hours. It will be fun. <laughs> my plan is to play a game for maybe one more hour and then fall asleep and wake up tomorrow, 15 hours later.
<laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh my god. He's a beast. It happens when you try to attack me at night. <sighs> I know Kung Fu bitch. I slept for like six, seven hours. But there was one man watching his Chinese Kung Fu movies <laughs> till like 12 without headphones. And now we are waiting. Waiting for our arrival. We got to our destination. Let's take our stuff and get outside. This is no, no skate. We stored our bags inside the Xi'an Hotel next to the east gate of the city wall. We're looking for a breakfast and hopefully our rooms get cleaned up soon there is the most uh, famous soup in Xi'an yeah. wow. there is a boiled egg that? with some uh, <laughs> tea tea egg mm -hmm. actually it's boiled with uh, soy sauce and uh, some um, spicy this is xiaomi zhou xiaomi hongdou zhou there is a millet porridge mm -hmm. with uh, red pin red ah, pea yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. it's a dou jiang made of soybean <laughs> Mm -hmm. The soy milk, you call it soy milk. Mm -hmm. This is tofu oh. love. This is tofu love. I have, uh, I have um, mentioned that in Beijing. It's between the the let's see, the tofu and the soup and the soy soy sauce, soy milk. So this is drier than this. They're same thing. But this one, you can put this thing inside. Or ask them give some sugar if you want to sweet. With sugar in the tofu. How much is it? Four Four yuan each for hula soup and the tofu lao. Okay, four yuan. Never try, never know, brother. 